Hi guys, it's Winter Song Briars here, and I am going to show you a new and improved tour of my Briar Barn. I know I just did a tour video not that long ago, but I have a bunch of new stuff that I want to show you. And I also replaced pretty much all of the horses that were here with different ones, just because I wanted to. So yeah, I have to introduce you to all the new horses and show you the new stuff. So first of all, we have the round pen, and that has our sign which says Winter Song Stables, it says what we offer. And down here is our little horse statue. So in the round pen, we use it for like beginning students, for lunging, for turning out horses that are in a stall, or like the ones that are on stall rest, but can still go out and walk around a little bit. Over here is where we keep the jumps that we're not using when they're not set up in the arena, so we just have a variety of jumps. And then over here is one of our new additions. This is the private boarding area. This isn't our only boarding area, but it's the one for people who have like competition horses or horses that get excited easily and they want them to be in a more secluded area. So over here we have these two turnout paddocks. These are 24 seven turnout, so the horses are always out here. This is Upon a Star or Star. She is a four year old Arabian mare and her owner does halter with her and dressage. Over here are the two draft horses. The gray one is Mia and the roan is Napoleon. And he's a gelding, so they're fine together and they're like best friends. So this is their little paddock. This is our new three stall private barn. In the first stall we have Aria or Paint the Wind. Her owner is a girl who does 4-H, Western Pleasure, Halter, all that with her. This right here is Castiel's stall, but he is currently out. You'll see him later. Over here, this is Slough's Choice, or Slough. He is a grandson of Seattle Slough. He was a successful racehorse, and now he is a champion show jumper. And this is Charlotte. She owns the farm, and she's just giving him some water, taking care of the boarded horses. And over here... We have the main area. As you can see, this is a lot, there's a lot more stuff going on here, which is why this is like the private secluded area for boarding. So first of all, we have the arena, which is this whole area. It's very easy to access from all the barns and the pastures. And there's plenty of room. It's actually bigger now that we got rid of the main pasture. So over here we have Sarah. And she is riding her favorite horse, Afternoon Angel or Willow. They're just going for a nice bareback ride. And then down here is Lion, one of our dogs, and he's just running along with them. Over here is our lesson horse block. This is where we keep all the full-sized horses that are used in lessons for adults and kids. It's easy access to the arena and all that. Over here we have She's a Star or Marabella. She's a Morgan mare. And most of the stalls don't currently have name tags. Some of them do, so we'll have to fix that. This is Some Like It Hot or Chili. He does English Western and parades. And this is Ashley. She's currently visiting him. She's one of our young riders. The area she's standing in is also a grooming area. Like, if you don't want to tag your horse up in its stall, you can tie them out here. And it can be used as a wash stall, too. And this over here is Ghost. He's a Pasifino cross and he does English, and this is his friend Daisy. She's our bomb-proof older mare. She does English and Western. Now in here, we have another nice area. Over here, we have, like, posters, just little stuff. We have some halters and a bookcase down here. And in this stall, excuse the tag on his leg. Excuse my voice, too. I'm sick. This is Benjamin Blue, or Ben. He is Rachel's new horse. He's a show jumper, and he can do dressage as well. And he costs a lot of money. And back there is his food. He has some hay in his hay rack. In this stall, we have Ranger. I currently do not remember his show name, but he is a quarter horse stallion, and he is here being trained by Charlotte to do Western Pleasure, and he's currently doing really well. He's won a lot. There's one of his blue ribbons. He has some food back there. And both of these horses are stallions, so they're kind of separated away from the other horses. Over here we have some halters, an incomplete bridle, just some little stuff. 
a lesson schedule. Up here in the loft, we have blankets. These are like our anniversary blankets, and there's some other ones. There's some hay back there. There's just a little pillow to sit on. And over here is the pony section. This is where we keep all of our ponies. So these stalls are, they're, they are big enough to fit a horse, but they work better with the little ponies. So here is Ringmaster. He is our hackney stallion. He is currently in training for halter and driving by Charlotte, so he's not really used in the lesson program. And over here is Hershey and Megan. Megan's just visiting Hershey. He's a very good pony in our lesson program. And then over here is Misty. She does cross country, jumping. She's another popular pony on the larger side, so small adults can ride her too. And back here is our Marin Full Stall because it has this little like sheltered area, so it's outdoors and indoors. And that is Fabulous Surprise and her Colt Fabulous Circus. And the nice thing about this is you can open this without letting him out. And then you just open this if you want to get out Boulder or Little Boulder. He's our Kiger Mustang. He's two years old and he's pretty fresh off the range. And over here is another new addition. It is our attack and feed room and it has a working door. We have some posters on the walls. And we have over here are our saddle pads, English and Western. We have a lot. It's more than it looks like. And then back there is Western saddles. Over here is our pony tack and our less expensive English horse tack. And then over here is our nicer tack that generally goes on our larger horses. Back here is, that's just a breastplate and a girth. And then we have some racks where there are some bridles and halters. So if you need a halter and you can't find one, there's some here. That is Rachel and she's just getting a bridle. And down there is a little tack grooming box. It has some polo wraps and carrots and brushes in it. Back there is a little feed bag thing. And then over here we have our bins. These are actually just empty Tic Tac containers that I peeled the label off and they make cute little bins because you can open them and shut them. So we have Marin Full Feed, Sweet Feed, some supplements, other feed, there's just helmets and a little table. So that is our feed room, and it has beautiful blue carpeting. I made this today, and I like it a lot, because it's easy to keep everything in one place. Over here is another area of stalls. This is kind of mixed, because this is Willow's stall, who is out there. And Willow is an aborted horse. She's just owned by the farm. But these two horses are owned by Ben. And he's obviously rich if he can afford to stall board two horses, but he also has taken over our Western lesson program. This is his new horse, Captain. He's a paint gelding, and he is used in Western pleasure and all that. And Ben is just taking care of him. And then over here is his other horse, Aurora Borealis, or Aurora. And she is also used in Western pleasure. And he also teaches lessons on her. And over here is our last new addition, which is a really ugly little wash stall area. You can tie your horse up here. This is Castiel, or Angel of the Lord. And he is Samantha's new horse, and she is our dressage instructor. And she has crazy hair. He's a Lusitano. Down here is like a scrub brush. These are supposed to be shelves, but they're not big enough to fit anything on, so just ignore that. And that is Castiel's stall. Oh, in this barn they also have nice mats in the stalls. So yeah, we'll do a little aerial view. So round pen, private boarding area, and then we have the arena, we have the lesson area over here, we have the stallion stalls and all the blankets and stuff in the loft. We have the pony block, all our ponies. We have the tack and feed room, and then more boarding area. 